Welcome back everybody to the um, continuation of Robocop Part 3 uh, Continued from earlier on How is everybody t tonight? I hope they're well One of the things I will be doing from uh, from now on when I when I do two two streams, do the the same what same game. From now out, I'm not going. Well, I I used to be, just basically do one two part one part two etc etc. But now I've I've pretty much decided that if I'm if I'm doing the same game a few times. I'm just going to get go say what part it is and then continue from earlier on that that day, this day, if that makes sense. When I stopped for a bit of a break before, I was thinking of coming out of the game and seeing where it where it saved but then I thought so I may as well uh, just do a bit, a bit longer on uh, this until I know it's a definite save point and then it'll, it'll more than likely be uh, time to give me give me a uh, cat's uh, medication give, a, give them uh, the tea give myself my tea Which is going to be quite an interesting tea. I could bought some um, flavoured chicken and sort of drumsticks and wings earlier on. Well, this morning. And I've had them in the oven. I was meant to have them, have a few earlier on. And then I've got um, stir fry for my tea, which. I was going to basically debone the chicken and then throw it in me. Well, either throw it in or Mr. Fry, or just have it as separate on the plate, sort of thing. So it, it's going to be a bit of a, well, late dinner. Although I never, I never really eat during the day. Usually eat loads just at night time. So what I've got for today, I'll put, I'll, I'll probably end up eating by the end of the day. Right, so. Uh, still got sound. Um, still got another crime somewhere, but that might be the one that is earlier on uh, that. It might be this. What happened? Can you believe this? A bunch of repeat offenders came up with a bright idea to storm the courthouse. For some reason, they think that if they destroy it, their prior convictions will go away. They took hostages and are now demanding both a 6,000 SUX and a plane to Acapulco. Acapulco is a war zone. I don't think these guys follow the news. But I'm afraid that it may be too late to rescue the hostages if we wait for SWAT. If they want to fly into a war zone, I have first class tickets for them. Backup has arrived.
Right, so... I'm going to have to shoot people straight away. Oh no. Um... I'll set off the metal detector. That's the way I want to go. <laughs> Let's just throw it. You got no chance. What we got there? We can do this. Another one up top somewhere. There he is. Wonder if I can actually pick up the grenade and throw it back. My gun doesn't feel as powerful. Robocop is here. Another one down there. But I don't think I want to go upstairs. I don't think I want to go down the stairs or anything until I've... I don't think there's anything around this bit. Shooting their heads off, they don't meet our demands soon. Who? Hostages? The police? That's the problem, man. We're still waiting because nobody can understand what you mean. You don't make our demands clear enough. They're probably thinking, why do we need an SUX if we want a plane too? Listen, and shut up. Where is that fucking stomping coming from? I was trying to shoot him on the way down. Uh, 
Uh, well, hopefully I can go through this door. Oh, I just got myself stuck. Card required. Is it in the office and yeah? No card there. <laughs> so that's where I need to go. Check down that way, nothing around there. Right, now I am a bit confused.
I was trying to say there's something there, but... But there is nothing there. Can't do my skills up here, can I? Hey, I can. Um, Uh, that seems to be the, the only one. Cause it won't let me through any of these doors. Oh, what's that? Ah, oh, no. Must be missing something. I don't know, here's the... Don't tell me I can't get out of this now either.
I am so confused. There doesn't seem to be anything on the desk. This seems to be the only way that I can go. I wonder what I'm going after. Is it really going to do this to me, is it? The aim's not very good. Another minute, and I'll start shooting their heads off. They don't meet our demands soon. Oh, hostages! It's gonna blow. Another, no, that's just to the stairs. Nothing on there. I don't know how to... Or was it before I spent the points, was it?
Uh, I need some earth medicine. God. Something that simple that was missing. So that's uh, downstairs cleared. That'll be that door that I can go into now. Right, just that one door. my boss and confirm what happened here. He wouldn't believe that I was taken hostage for the third time this week. Stay here. The police will come to question you. Third time this week. I wondered what uh, what it was. <laughs> it's there. job done. wonder if that's me, um, six out of six. Hey, Robo, you showed them. It was a pleasure to work with you. Five out of six still. Right, 
I'll move all the way along this way. Want to try and get the bonus points. What's he doing there? Oh, so is she. I have a feeling there's not going to be anything down here. There's crime going on somewhere in the city. I need to try and track it down. The only way that I can do that is So that, that's all that checked. So That's the uh, cash machine. I wonder if I've got enough to do that yet. Um, I need to try and think where the cash machine was. Whatever, uh, may as well check this way then. I heard OCP is broke. What, are you afraid you'll lose money on your stocks? Where could it be? gonna turn Robo off when he wins.
Okay, so what am I? Let's uh, if we go straight across and left. So if you're right. Then work around the outskirts and then work my way in. I don't care if OCP lost some money for once. Well, that's where I uh, come from before. You know what, it's, a, it's only one mission, isn't it? One side mission. I'll probably come across it on my way back now. The day shift. <laughs> That's a crap, though, isn't it? I suppose technically she's only stand standing there. Sense an ambush. Let's see if I can walk down these that be silent. Robocop can do stealth mode. First they can't even connect a few fucking cables, and now they don't even answer. It's Robocop, he can't be silent. It's the new guy. <laughs> He's waiting for some big wig to show up. He's planning to do some psycho presentation. And who is the big wig? That's what I want to find out. Mr. W, we still have no contact with the funhouse. I'm on the phone. We're ready. I understand, but please tell him that this is not a meeting that can be postponed. Let's see. So, 
They ain't coming, right? Fucking suits! Keep your anger to yourself, or I'll share mine with you. Rambo? Who's there? Show yourself! You'd better not. As you wish, creep. You are under arrest. Come quietly. Do you really believe that's what's gonna happen? Take care of him, boys. I'll meet you on the roof. What's up, metal freak? Forget where you left your car? You better go, Miss Ortiz. It seems there will be... Trouble. Trouble. Just, uh, that's how that is. <clears throat> Just had to get my notification on my phone. Is that, Is that you? you? Come, Come to, to us. us. Yeah, Dad, Dad we're, we're waiting for you. For you. Well, that was a bit weird. Ending corridor. Dad, are you here? I'm scared. Come find me, please. Why won't you come for me, Dad? Don't leave me, please. Don't leave me alone. Dad? I thought it would have been something, something nice.
Special offers at Juneberry Mall. Now a free gift for engaged couples. Uh, okay. Jewelry has a discount on wedding rings. Choose something special. It's a symbol of your love and something for her to remember you by after you decided to get yourself killed and leave your family all alone, Alex Murphy. Don't hesitate. Come and take advantage of our offer. Murphy. Over here, Murphy. Is that, Is that you? You? You, you, you look, look different. different. You're, You're scaring, scaring me. me. I, I, don't I don't like how scary, scary you are now. now. It's, it's not, not your, your dad, dad kid. kid. It's, it's not, not even, even a police, police officer. officer. I don't, I don't know, know what, what it is anymore. Right, so I've got to get a key from somewhere. Which will be where it's telling me to go in here. The remains of my husband, a police officer killed in the line of duty, were used to create some kind of a metal monster. I need to bury it to move forward with my life. Do you have a funeral suit that would fit that? Okay. It thinks itself as you. A world-class husband. A father. A cop. Did you hear? It's true. You're not one of us anymore. You're not human. And you're, and you're not, not a, a real cop. You're, you're just, just the rotting, rotting remains of Alex Murphy. You're, you're something that should never have been. What does what? Something that should not exist. We have to fix you. We have to erase you. And we will. Just come to us. Come to the rooftop. We're waiting. It's the crap that is stuck to our shoe. A cuckoo egg planted by OCP. We need to clear our station of this shit. We must smash that thing. Fire at will. You're not one of us. You're gonna huh? feel that too. Don't. Fire! I wasn't sh shooting at them. You're back. There's coffee in the kitchen. Dad, can you fix the camera? I think something's broken. Hey, you fixed it! Remember I'm playing a game this afternoon? Dad wouldn't miss it, would he? Pick me up at the station. Yeah. 
position. I'll grab my gear. Do you really have to go? You look so sexy in that uniform. Why won't you stay a little longer? Dead end. Why are you here? Do you not love your family? No attachment. Everyone wants to be back home with their families. Be back home. But we um scene of the crime. Welcome, Chopper. Let's take a stroll through your old home. Do you think you can just go back? Go on. This, this is a one-family one house, house, built by ZM Industries. It's for, it's sale, for sale because, because the head of the family, Long, was shot in the head. Your family has forgotten. Why do you want to remember them? You attach yourself to something that is the weakest in you. To the part that's still human. Thought it over. Why not make me an offer? Why carry this burden? What, what is, is your, your sacrifice, sacrifice worth? worth? Holding on to them makes you weak. Destroy them. Destroy them before they destroy you. Alex Murphy, the one and the only. I'm here because you have something that belongs to me. You have my badge. Lewis gave it to me. Lewis is hurt because of you. Because you keep insisting that you're something that you're not. You think that you are a fusion of me and this metal armor, but you're not me. Not even a part of me. I'm dead and I want to finally rest, but you won't let me. Your delusions keep tormenting me and my family. You need to let us go. I want my badge back. I have it. So I remember. Remember what? The lie? Lewis knows us. She would not lie. Give it to me. It's mine. But, Lewis, I want it back. This is my badge. Then I'll have to take it back myself. You are strong enough to take him. Don't forget you have a partner who's counting on you. Take this gift. Don't, Don't forget, forget who you, you are. are. Alex, Alex Murphy. Murphy. Was it meant to shoot him? Or... Get up, for God's sake. That's it, Robo. Keep going. Where's the chopper? The cops will be here any... Wendell Antonowski. Haven't you had enough yet? You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. Relax. I, I'm not your enemy. If I were, you would have already... You have the right to an attorney. Hey! I, I wanted to help you. Release you from the burden of your past life, of your memories. But you, you don't want to lose them, right? Now I get it. Anything you say may be used against you. I can give you back those memories. All of them. We should help each other. We have the same boss! Police! God damn it, you again? People need to see this. Cuff him. He is a cop killer. Hands behind your back! Can you hand me my lighter? It's a family heirloom. I wouldn't want to lose it. You mean this trinket? Evidence. It's safer in the prison depository. 
You'll pick it up yourself in... I don't know, 150 years? Plenty of time for rehabilitation. Top story. Wendell Antonowski, the infamous new guy in town, has been apprehended today. Robocop was able to capture Antonowski, as reported by an eyewitness, Channel 9 Samantha Ortiz. Unfortunately, no footage of the event has emerged. Robocop's efforts have prompted a public debate regarding his status as a human being. Here's a statement from John Mills, a candidate for the mayor's office in the upcoming mayoral election. Today, Robocop has done more for this city than the current administration has done in its entire term. That's why I feel that it's time to give something back. If elected, I will be advocating to grant Robocop the status of a free, living human being. That's right. Vote Mills, vote Robocop. Staying on the topic of OCP, the CEO of Omni Consumer Products suffered a heart attack earlier today. The self-made entrepreneur has been taken to the Gibson Memorial Hospital for observation. His condition is stable. We wish you a speedy recovery. Wendell's in prison and the old man is on his way out? Could this day be any better? Geez, Steph, don't you have any respect? Here's the man of the hour. Congrats, Robo. You caught that bastard for what he did to Lewis. We are not done yet. Murphy, come talk to me after you're done with your evaluation. I have to sort as well. Um... I can I not change me appearance? Maybe that's something I can only do at the uh, start. I just knew he'd be the one to bust that asshole. Glad we have Murphy on the team. Are you having problems getting a hospital appointment? Are you oh, I think I've got a problem with all of a sudden the radio on. Is that the TV personality I keep seeing on television? It's time to I have a seat, right? Something not many people know about me. I used to be a car mechanic before I landed this job. Is that supposed to put us at ease, Morgan? Well, he's a mechanic, so... I got an A for that, did I? Happy days. Congratulations on catching Wendell. You seem to constantly be front page news. Not only that, your situation has become a topic of public debate. I imagine that could take a toll on anyone. How are you dealing with other people trying to determine your identity for you? Also, Someone is fighting for my <laughs> rights. That's probably the healthiest way of looking at it. But the status of a human would make you an autonomous being. It opens many doors. Being given human rights would let you fully take control of your life. Is that something that you'd actually want?
I don't, I'm not sure. What did they mean by other people? The government or just the public? I deserve yes, it. Yes, I deserve it. And why is that? I am human. The idea of granting you human rights is a very important issue. But no more important than the main reason for today's session. Many people might not be aware of that, but I have the whole report on the heavy glitches that you suffered before capturing Wendell. The only other time you've experienced anything similar was during the Slaughterhouse incident. That's when your partner was wounded. Now, you were fighting the person responsible for it. Do you think the severity of those glitches is caused by the intense feelings that you have towards either of them? Um... I do not know. Don't worry. You're not alone on this. I am here to help you figure it out. Let's dig a little deeper. Your typical glitches are triggered by sensory stimulation, similar to how most people experience memories when exposed to particular sights, sounds, or smells. But this wasn't the case with the other glitches that you experienced recently? No, they triggered randomly. That's what I suspected. And now tell me, what did they seem like to you when you experienced them? Corrupted visions of my past. I think we're onto something. Your usual glitches were making you recall memories. No more harmful than remembering your wedding day when hearing Mendelssohn's march. We have to differentiate them from those severe malfunctions that you experienced in the slaughterhouse and at the mall. Those latter ones are the real problem, and we need to get to the bottom of it. But I think I've gathered quite a lot of valuable data, and at our next session, I'll present my conclusions. Hey, Robo, could you stop by the cells on your way to read? Someone there wants to speak to you. Pickle's been arrested again. I think I need some more combat, really. Let's have a look at uh, do some upgrades now. That one can go there. Um That one can go there. Um, that one can go there. That one I can put there. 
Uh, right, there's another one of them. Up there. I've got to just stop. I suppose I could put that there. Because I'm taking the loss anyway. That one there. So can I get better than the f that 14 there? Merge that one to that one. That one. on that one that one that one and that one and that one Up and down, up and down. Up and down. Right, so now I can put that one there. that one there uh, so I need put that one there And then I think that'll have to do me for now. If it happens, I'm definitely getting sacked. I've got a degree in robotics, not in human relations. Sometimes I'm right, you prison go. cells. Says, went right past it. Hey. I'd recognize those footsteps anywhere. What's he done this time? What did you do this time? <laughs> uh, why does it have to be that I did something? 
Maybe one of your guys just got a little overeager. Did they? No. But none of this matters. I'm here mainly to congratulate us. We did it. We got the guy. We? We sure did, partner. Any new leads? Are you looking for trouble? This is the they lived happily ever after part of the story. Wendell was conducting suspicious activity for someone at OCP. I want to know who. Shit. I thought you were just looking to avenge your partner. I forgot that you're a dutiful officer. All right. I'll keep my ear to the ground and see what the streets are saying. Good. Talk to you later, partner. Did you hear? The old man had a heart attack. Seriously? The hand, rookie. Actually, I do. Murphy, in Still my office. Still to work with one hand. You'll eventually forget um, being shot. already. <laughs> yeah, when? Catching Antonowski put a smile time. on a lot of people's what? faces. But we still have one unresolved issue. Catching his accomplice at OCP. Exactly. And when everyone realizes that OCP's been sabotaging us the whole time, mentions of a strike will come up again. We don't want that. So who do you think it is? Becker is an obvious choice. I just don't know if that's not too obvious. Do you suspect that Becker is on Windows payroll? All signs point to him. They do, don't they? And that leads me to another thing. Becker wanted to meet you. You're supposed to show up at some old factory. And he wanted you to come alone. A rather unusual request. Um, That's why I'll get Officer Washington to listen in. By the way, how do you feel about it? Can you trust him? Despite shortcomings, he is trying his best. That makes me a little less anxious about signing him up to look after you. I'm skeptical of anyone that OCP tries to push on us. First Becker, then Washington. And let's not forget about Dr. Blanche. Speaking of which, Dr. Blanche, is she... Is she being helpful? Are you getting anything out of those sessions? This process takes time. Like most things that are worthwhile. I will meet Becker, but there is a place I will visit first. Sure thing. In the meantime, I'll brief your overseer. Officer Washington! Yes, sir. You've got a new assignment. I'm ready and willing. All the way to the basement. Wonder if he sorted out the missed suspension. Technically, if they put their eyes a bit higher, it might not catch. Just a thought. If he didn't wheel spin, it tires would last a bit longer. <laughs> Did you watch the game yesterday? I don't know what's wrong with our team. We're losers. I wanted to throw the TV out. The window, but it was too heavy. I pulled a hamstring because of them. Now 
think we're off to see how low this is. Lewis, Lewis. It's Lewis, isn't it? Wait, why are you asking me about my liver and kidneys? They shot me in the leg. We can She's waiting for you, Murphy. Come on, give me the skinny. I want to know everything. Oh, Murphy, we started the party a little early. I hope you don't mind. Sorry, partner. It's my fault. I just got to hear what's happening at the precinct. In usual fashion, OCP's doing everything in its power to keep the police down. Come on. This is time to celebrate. Louis is feeling better. Wendell's in jail. Let's party. If you don't think a strike is brewing... You know what? Let me get this grouch out of here so that you two can talk. Okay, okay. I'm going. Feel better, Louis. You look well. I gotta admit, I sleep better knowing that you got that bastard. But what about you? How have you been lately? Did you get any more of those visions? I still see things. You know, ever since Antonowski showed up, they seem to be happening more often. And with greater intensity. I don't think I've ever seen you in such a state. I just know how it affects me. So I can't imagine how it affects you. The fact that he's the brother of one of those guys who... shot you. We should not let the past haunt us. Easier said than done. His presence reminds me of the day that I... that I left you. I often think that maybe if we didn't split up that day, things would have gone down differently. Neither of us could have predicted the consequence of our actions. That doesn't make me feel any less guilty. What I don't get is if Wendell is actually the brother of one of your murderers, then why did he come out now? After all this time? And why didn't he kill you when he got a chance? That is what I intend to find out. Right. Is it true that he's working with someone from OCP? That is what he claims. Damn Becker. We should just lock him up already. We do not have proof. Not yet. I don't know if you heard, but the old man ended up in this hospital after his heart attack. I'm not even sure if he's in a state to talk, but it probably wouldn't hurt to check if he knows anything, right? Anyway, I think I need a little rest after all this excitement. Thank you for visiting me. We'll be back to working together in no time. I look forward to it. That's a... Uh, yeah, it's got insane. Now I need to... Go see what condition the old man's in. Did you hear? We're moving the old man to a private clinic in 20 minutes. Good. I don't think I can last a minute longer in this stench. Hey, where do you think you're going? To talk to the old man. You're the only one who actually showed up to pay him a visit. You know he talks about you a lot. Does he? Yeah, about you being granted human rights. He's rooting for you. So maybe it's not such a bad idea. You can go in. Michael, is that you? Your halo shines so bright. Do not worry, you are safe. Robocop? You came to see me? Like a real friend would? I'm getting close to my final days. I just can't stand this uncertainty. 
But you came back from the other side. Tell me, how was it? Was it unbearable? The pain was, is crushing, but every officer is aware of the risk. That is not what I wanted to hear. I believe huh. that death isn't the end. You are walking proof of that. Unfortunately, I have not completed all I set out to do. All saboteurs inside OCP won't let me. Are you referring to Max Becker? That weasel seeks not only to destroy you, but also my company. Be wary of him. I know you would never let anyone jeopardize the good name of OCP. <sighs> Before you go, could you be so kind? And give me some painkillers. I am not qualified to administer medication. Please. Anyone help me? Go! Oops. I need my painkillers. How much longer do I have to stand this? Why the long face, Robo? They'll pump him full of OCP's cocktails and come Monday morning he'll be back to signing deals. I suppose there's not any painkiller. It's probably kind of too late now. No matter what, I could give him some painkillers and then he'd have another heart attack or something. I am the mayor of this city. Robocop, you have to intervene. Is there a problem? This man is preventing me from exposing OCP's hypocrisy. The way this hospital treats its patients is the best depiction of what OCP wants to do with this city. A brave policewoman shot in the line of duty is crammed into a small room while the old man has a cozy VIP wing of the hospital all to himself. This is what Delta City stands for. Even bigger division. But the time you had your tonsils removed, you were staying in the VIP wing, too. We're not talking about me. We need to talk <laughs> about the people. Robocop, please stop this madness. Make a statement. That policewoman is your partner, isn't she? So tell us, doesn't she deserve better? She, d she does, but then I'll end up getting into a hospital is not an appropriate place for political scuffles. Avoid it. <laughs> Just what I expected from an OCP robot. They want to ruin this city. They want to take it away from the citizens, but I won't let them. Say no to Delta City. Vote for the neighborhoods. Vote for Kuzak. Okay, guys, we're leaving. We should find him a cozy, secluded, preferably padded room. I suppose I should have actually gone on given the other answer and said, yeah, she does deserve better. Which, technically, she does, but then. Maybe he wants to thank you for catching Wendell. I only seek answers. So you can follow a command. Surprising. Surrender or there will be trouble. 
Defiant as usual. Your creator screwed up the job by not installing an off switch. Well, it doesn't pay to fix their mistakes. It's cheaper just to replace you. So, Robocop, meet the future of law enforcement. Ah, nice. Um... Power like yours, but at the push of a button. That is why it is not only more effective than you, but infinitely more obedient. That's just a fragment of the speech I had prepared. But hell, this product speaks for itself. Robocop, what's the status? This is no appreciation party. Gunshots? What's going on? Becker has introduced me. I like it. Terminating aggression. Don't get excited. This was just a warm up. Robocop, I got something. A headless UED will start shooting other droids. It's a bug that ended a presentation in front of the OCP. That's handy to know. I'm looking at the footage now. Let us see if they ever got around to fixing it. Warm up is over. Get ready for the real strike. I knew the guy that made you. Bob Morton, right? An arrogant brown nose. I used to be happy that he was dead. He's fine. One last asshole on my way to the church. Now, I wish he would. Project. The old man didn't like it much and wanted to shut it down. He was certain that your brain was what was making you superior to them, so Becker continued to work on the project in secret. He took a big gamble. Hey, who are you talking to? Is that Oedipus guy helping you? Well, once I'm done with you, his career is over. You are durable, I'll give you that. You could become a strong part of my urban enforcement unit.
Tucker knows you are helping me. He gave me access to the OCP data himself. Under these circumstances, I feel obliged to use them any way I see fit. Until now, I didn't want to damage you too much, but no more. Look at that.
carry need to try and find some help just happened Becker oh just stop right there great performance Robocop and mr. Becker it was an excellent presentation you promised to show me a reliable remedy for this crime wave and you really did yes I've been working on UEDs for the past five I'm in Robocop He's proved once again that he's still the top player. Excuse me? It just barged in here and started accusing me of conspiracy without a shred of proof. It is not stable. I have Wendell's confession. Oh, do you mean the guy that's been harvesting human organs? <laughs> Very reliable source. You keep forgetting that your organic components are the bane of my entire existence. They complicate things. I need a simple tool. A tool that I can control, and until this remote is in my hands, I have that... Oh! Well, it's uh, time for me to go. Thank you, Mr. Becker, for your presentation. I'll be watching the progress of your project. But until then, keep up the excellent work, Robocop. And you better keep an eye on that remote. That's a fun bit of action. That should do it. What's going on over there? Becker's here, and the cops are not happy. Becker tested an army of robots on Robocop. Can you believe that? That is so unethical to conduct an experiment without our supervision. Right. Right, so can't do any upgrades yet. Um, well. 
Where's that one, that one, and that one? That one, uh, that one, and that one. Well, I only got two of them, haven't I? Uh, It's a new age, and you have to accept it. My robots are here to stay. Detroit will become the first city policed entirely by my machines. No brains, no glitching, total control. So that's it? You just gonna replace us? You've already been replaced, honey. Can't you see it? What are you talking about? Murphy's one of us. You're a little confused. That's Robocop you're talking about. Murphy's the guy who's legally dead. That's it. We are going on strike. We are cops. Cops do not go on strike. That's the spirit, old timer. I have important people to meet, multi-million dollar contracts to sign. You know, the usual. Well, that sucks. We can't just sit here and do nothing. You can do something. Your cruiser needs cleaning after your last shift. If you have a heart... Hard time finding something to do, come to me. That goes for the rest of you too. Murphy, briefing room, now. Yes, sir. Ratio. I've got a thing for radios. After the celebration of Guatemalan independence. First of all, I don't want to hear a word about those damn robots. We have a job to do. Now that the milk is spilled, we are looking for a mole in OCP that's been protecting Antonowski. As hard as it is to believe, Becker is not that guy. Yeah, but he's still a prick. Sure is, but there's still a mole that we need to find. It's gotta be the rookie. I'm sitting right here. So? We start by asking the source. What are you suggesting? I pay Wendell a visit in jail. Good thinking. You can try to squeeze a confession out of him. If I get my hands on him, I will squeeze more than just a confession. Hey, Murphy! That news lady's in the lobby waiting to talk to you. Robo, do you have a minute? I suppose. <laughs> Listen, I wanted to say that I misjudged you. My crusade is against OCP. You were just collateral. So to extend an olive branch, I'd, I'd like to give you this. What is it? It's the tape of you glitching the other day at the mall. It's the only copy, so you can do whatever you want with it. I am sure your TV station would love to play the tape. Yeah, that's why you need to take it before I change my mind. Thank you. Now that I have you here, can I interview you as a consolation prize? They want me to ask you about the election. Seems that people value your opinion. I would be happy to oblige. Okay, roll the tape. 
I don't do interviews. I'm here at Metro West conducting an interview with a man that needs no introduction. Robocop. One of the more contentious points brought up during the election is the construction of Delta City. Many believe that Delta City will destroy old Detroit. Mayor Kuzak spoke at length about the illegal evictions that OCP has been planning in order to start the construction. Other candidates, namely John Mills, believe that Delta City is a chance to clean up the city. What are your thoughts on this subject? Is Delta City the future of old Detroit? No comment. I would focus on current Detroit. Thank you for clarifying your stance on this important topic. This has been Robocop for Channel I think that's Samantha kind Ortiz, of staying mutual. signing off. <laughs> Thanks for the interview, Robo. We'll get out of your hair as soon as we're done packing up the equipment. I saw Becker tear the rookie a new one for what he did at that factory. Oh, she is doing real good. She had that fire. That's it. I think I'll um get where I need to go and then um, call it the end for now. Got tea waiting for me. Well, half waiting for me. In series, soon as I get out of the car, it should, it should save. So, it, I think technically it should save it there. So, uh, so I'm going to call it a day for now and then I'll be back on uh, tomorrow hopefully. So thanks for watching, hit that follow button, it'd be much appreciated and I'll uh, catch you in the next one.